On a windy, cold day in Lawrenceville, Georgia, I've got the hottest hitter in the ballpark and Chloe Goins, who's our Grizzly today, presented by Jets Pizza on Sugarloaf Parkway. Chloe, glad to have you up here. Thanks, Matt. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Doing well, and we'll check to the highlights here as the Grizzlies come into today's contest versus an all-too-familiar opponent in Truett McConnell. You're off to your senior season. Kind of give me an idea. What's the, what's your approach here? You're, you're swinging a great bat right now for the Grizzlies. Come out hot in game number one. Kind of what's going through your mental process as you dig in the right-handed batter box well starting this season coach cat told me i was my best self when i was my freshman year and just playing for fun so this year i'm just out here playing my last year for fun because once it's over it's over and you want to remember every minute of it so i'm doing everything i can just to be out here have fun and enjoy my teammates and playing the game well it was an absolute pleasure for us we had a lot of fun watching you guys have fun in game number one but it wasn't fun early we got down twice big in game number one what does it mean for this team and their character in 2024 to come back, to have a come-from-behind victory the way they did in game number one? Well, we know that, like, within our team, we all we have fight. Like, we have a lot of fight and a lot of grit, and it doesn't matter how it gets done as long as it gets done. So going down 3-0, top of the first, was no big deal to us because you got to score to win anyways is our mindset. So it was real easy for us to just keep the energy up in the dugout because it's a really big thing and score those runs back really quickly. Three pitchers used along with 11 different position players, 14 in total to get that game one victory. Big, huge performance by Molly Peacock out of the bullpen. Three and two-thirds innings pitch, threw up a big zero in the fifth inning. How big was that performance in the fifth to keep that momentum our dugout to get those two runs in the fifth and the sixth? Yeah, Molly, she's worked so, so hard to be this pitcher for us. She puts in work every single day. And for her to come out here and prove to us and to the coaches that she's capable of putting those zeros up in big moments is just so big for her as well as us because – in that moment, we really needed to stop them from scoring considering the back and forth that we've been having. So the big zero and the hard work really paid off for Molly today, and we're so proud of her. A three-hit performance for you, not on the day, but in game number one. Mm -hmm. Their pitcher had a really tough changeup. A lot of the Grizzlies were off, off balance, were off balance, but what does that say about you and your adjustments at the plate to maybe a pitch didn't go your way in that bat, but you kept that calm, you kept that composure, and still delivered base hits? What's that mean for you? Um... I mean, it shows growth within myself just because, like, in the past, I would just be, like, all in my head and, like, screw it up the next time. But I knew if she was going to throw it that I had to sit on it and let it get deep before I hit it. And that's kind of been my approach lately. Um, I struggled a lot being really early on the ball, but I have to see it deep, see it from the hip, and just hit it. Well, it's going well for you right now. You've got a team-high seven-game hitting streak going right now for yourself. Today alone, five for seven, two RBIs, three runs scored. Your senior season, you're talking about you're having fun, but it's a different story when coach puts you in that two spot, mm -hmm. puts you in center field, and you produce. What's that mean to you? Uh, it just shows that she has confidence in me, truly. Uh, I know that I'm capable, but to know that the other people around me and that the coaching staff knows that I'm capable puts a lot of confidence in me, and uh, it helps me be confident for my teammates as well to know that, like, I'm here and, like, I got you guys' back if something goes wrong. Uh, Chloe, I, c I can't say it enough here in front of everybody. You, you're, you're just – you're – energy you got a glow about yourself your senior year and it's just showing not only on the field but it's now coming through from a productivity standpoint and, and i hope the fun continues to go for mm -hmm. you in the grizzlies but uh you're a grizzly of the day and, and we wouldn't be serving her justice without bringing it up here annalise jarvis may be the grizzly of the week uh <laughs> in combined effort 12 innings of perfect softball all week long and so I, we're going to have to talk to Dale to get the official wording, whether today was a perfect game or not. But 12 perfect innings and in four appearances this week for the Grizzlies. What's it look like in center field when she's it's out there throwing? It's outstanding. It's so easy to play behind her. Sometimes I get distracted because I catch myself not focusing when she's in the mound. No balls go and play. So I'm just like picking grass out there, playing with the birds. I don't know. It's crazy. But so glad to have her on our team because <laughs> hitting against her is not very fun. We do it in practice, and she wins most of the time. Four-game winning streak now for George Winnett, 14 and 2 on the season and uh, a great day to celebrate kind of wrap up this week too weather's in the forecast so we're not gonna be able to play Rio Grande tomorrow and Saturday so Chloe with that you've got the final words get us some shout outs and take us home for this weekend I've been thinking about these a lot yeah let's go I'm excited let's go so first shout out to my parents and my grandparents and family back home thank you guys for always being here and if you're not here I know you're watching it on the TV right now so it was cold everyone thank gets you. a pass <laughs> everyone gets a pass today it was so cold the only thing that kept us warm was Chloe's bat so uh, you're, you're, you're okay um shout out to my roommates I love them they're such big support system and then 
so easy. They have the best listening ears ever because we love to come home and rant to them. Uh, huge shout out to Haley. So proud of her for overcoming her um, little slump she was in. She crushed it today. She did an outstanding job in the second game. Couldn't have started that rally without her. And, of course, Annalise, from our words, she pitched a perfect game today. That's her fourth one for us Grizzlies, and we are so, so, so proud of her. So that will do it. I love it. Chloe, job well done. Thank you. That will do it for us here from Lawrenceville, Georgia, as GDC completes the sweep over Truett McConnell.